What is up everybody, Josh here again, and today we have a new Sons of the Forest video for you. Today we're going to be showing you where to find this. We call it the Solophyte Generator. It's a device that generates Solophyte with your artifact. Let's get into it, shall we? To get the Solophyte Generator, you're going to come all the way down south. It's going to be on the very southwest corner of the map. As you can see here, not too far from that rocky ledge there. And that is north that we're facing. And what you're going to be doing is looking on the beach. It should be quite easy to find from the beach. And you'll see a rock with some fences around it. And one of the fences are conveniently knocked over for you to go in. So we're going to go inside and show you this little mini cave that contains the blueprint. I think in the front here, you're going to need to knock down some boards. And then we'll head back in here. We'll see some crosses and stuff like that. Just head straight back into the back here. There's some cans and skulls and some bones laying around. You can pick those up if you wish to do so. Let's we'll see a bunch of skeletons. And then the very back of the cave here, you'll see a ton of skeletons. Kind of like an arrow. <laughs> kind of shaped in the form of an arrow. And that leads straight to the blueprint. And that is the blueprint for the Solophyte Generator, or the thing that generates Solophyte with your artifact. And it takes some bones, skulls, and large rocks to craft. Then once you get back to where you're going to place it, all you got to do is go to your notes, go down to the very bottom, and whichever page it's on. If you have all the notes, it's probably going to be towards the end there. And it's right there. And then all you got to do is place it and put the mats in it. Then just take your artifact that you have and you need to right click and activate it. And what that will do is that will start it producing solophyte and it'll produce solophyte and you see solophyte around the skulls. Be very careful though that this does attract cannibals and sometimes really large ones. Depending on your game day, I do believe. Or not. I haven't actually seen a single cannibal, so I don't know what's... I don't know. It's, uh... Could be just a fluke or a bug, possibly. I have been attacked, though, when I've activated this before. But it's been a little bit of time, and now we have Soul Fight just kind of sitting there. So you can hit E on these skulls right here and grab some Soul Fight Ore. That's pretty much it. I don't believe it does anything else but generate Solophyte Ore, which is actually pretty nice. Not that Solophyte Ore is hard to get in the game. So if you need Solophyte, I mean, you could use the generator, and the generator is great, don't get me wrong, but you could come to these sites that are now in the game in 1.0, and they look like little wrenches like this, and you'll go up, you could pick them off of the people, or you could keep them there if you want to keep them marked. You can also just kind of, you know, change the icon and throw it down, whatever you want to do. But if you come to these places, these always seem to have Solophyte, and this one is no exception to that. Down here, we'll see at the very bottom of the cave, there is a ton of it here, and all you need is a pickaxe to mine it. And we have a video on that on the channel if you're interested. We're going to be going through and updating a lot of our Sons of the Forest videos if they need updated. If not, we should have a video on the channel if you're looking for something. And if we don't have it, suggest it. We'll probably make one for you. And that's it for this video. Don't forget if you like what you see to like, comment, subscribe, and all that good stuff. Subscribe. We'll be coming out with some more Sons of the Forest videos here very shortly. And hopefully, we'll see you next time. Peace.